cataractcoach.com aspiration probe for the capsule orexis. So you can use gentle suction on the anterior lens capsule and hold it securely. So here we go, white cataract, and surgeon is starting off with an AC maintainer. Okay, let's see what else is next. Probably some tripen blue dye, or maybe that was already done. Looks a little bit blue already. And let's see the technique here. So the technique is just to use two paracentesis, two small incisions here. And so these two small incisions can go in. Let's see what we got here. Oh, there's the tripen blue dye. Again, with the AC maintainer, you may just wash it off. So maybe the AC maintainer is not on just yet. There we go. Now you're getting it washed out. And now poking in in the anterior lens capsule, it looks like some aspiration. Aspirating out some of that liquefied lens material. And going all around to do that. Remember, rock the nucleus. Get the fluid that's behind the nucleus as well. So good, good, good decompression. And once it's decompressed, this surgeon prefers to use, check this out, an aspirator. So this is a bimanual irrigation aspiration, but just the aspiration probe getting under the lens capsule that you already poked with the scissotome. Now, use your foot pedal, give a little bit of vacuum to hold on to that. Once you're holding the vacuum, check this out. You can tear it exactly where you want to tear it. So again, using the vacuum holding power of your FACO machine and this aspirator to hold the anterior lens capsule, the undersurface of it, while you create the capsule rexus. And completing it, pretty co good control. I really like it. And then last bit here, let's grab onto that. And you finished a beautiful rexus. Hey, I like it. Interesting technique. Not sure I'll end up using this so often, but it's a neat technique. And then remember, check out the Cataract Coach Podcast, the top podcast in all of ophthalmology. It teaches you how to be a more successful ophthalmologist wherever you are in the world. If you spend an hour a week listening to this, I promise it will help you tremendously. You can thank me later. Now, taking out that lens uh, capsule there, and let's cut ahead to another video of a case. There we go. Here's a new case. Same thing here, AC maintainer. And let's see, going in with a needle to poke into the lens capsule and aspirate. So, phaco aspiration or needle aspiration of the lens material. And then remember to rock it back and forth. Again, this is a liquefied lens cortex that's in front of the nucleus, but also behind it. Once that is done, using the irrigate or aspirator to go underneath the anterior lens capsule, hold on to it, some vacuum. And then... Look at that. You can create your capsule right. So innovative technique here. Not something I've tried before. Oh, look at this. Using the aspirator to even further decompress the capsule bag. I like that. So for me, I just prefer to use the forceps here. So creating the capsule rexus that looks like it's a little small. I'd prefer a little bit larger rexus than that. And continuing it. And with the AC maintainer there, you can see the fluidic currents cause the capsule to flop around a little bit. But there it is, a complete rexus. Again, you may have more control with the forceps. And let's see the surgeon now enlarging it, okay? A little bit. Can you enlarge it a little bit more than that? Let's find out together. And yes, oh, beautiful. I was going to say it's a little too small of a rexus, but a beautiful spiral out technique here. Now, leave us a comment below. Have you ever tried anything like this? Does this make sense to you? I think it's kind of a neat idea. And as, of course, on Cataracoach, you want the world's largest library. and has to be a complete library, so we feature the video. But I want to hear from you. Comment below.